Two months ago, I made a video talking about one of the worst YouTubers ever. He is absolutely terrible, and he's like a 45-year-old man. This dude's name is Evil Ash, and if you didn't see my first video that I made on him, basically, in that video, I figured out that he was a horrible YouTuber because he was making some of the worst content on the platform, very low-quality content, and somehow, he was getting a ton of views. I didn't plan on making another video on this guy just because the first time I made a video on him, his channel was horrible, and it kind of left me in a bad mood after I watched it, so I didn't really want to come back. But for some reason, earlier today, I remembered this guy. I decided to go look at his channel, and turns out, he has 5.6 million subscribers. When I made that video on him two months ago, he had 3 million. So you're telling me in two months, he got 2 million? He has to be doing something new or making good videos, because there's no way. I mean, if you just look at his content, you can see he's making the same freaking face in every single one of these videos. He is just doing the same pose in every video. Let's just watch his most recent video. Let's see what type of content he makes now. Let's see if he's still a bad YouTuber. I have a feeling he might be a good YouTuber though because there's no way you get 2 million subs. Let's see his most recent video. You laugh, you lose. That's what the video says. Okay, these are normally pretty cool. If you laugh, you go to hell. Wait, he just put like a little clip out of him for three seconds. And then he disappeared. Does he not even show up in this video? I ended up watching this whole video and surprisingly enough, he didn't show up in the whole rest of the video. And the clips that they showed weren't even funny. They showed a clip of a girl missing a bowling ball like, ha ha ha, so funny. That's not funny. So you're telling me this guy just put like a clip of him for like two seconds and then never showed up the rest of the video and just made like the robot text to speech talk the rest of the time? This isn't even his video. He literally stole clips. Okay, let's stop judging him. Let's go to his next video. This video says don't laugh. This looks... Is this gonna be the same thing? No way. If you laugh, you go to hell. Bro, what? It's the same exact thing. He shows a little picture of him for three seconds, and then it says, if you laugh, you go to hell. Like and subscribe and uh, share this with a friend. If they laugh, they go to hell too. His next video says, if you laugh, you're going to hell. This is the same exact thing. Okay, I need to figure out. Is he gonna put a picture of himself at the freaking start of the video for three seconds? No way he does it again. If you laugh, you go to hell. What? Bro, why does he keep putting a picture of himself at the start of the video? I can't believe I'm saying this right now, but his videos he used to make were probably better than the ones he's making now. He somehow became a worse YouTuber. If you saw that first video I made on him, at least he was actually in the video. Now, he wasn't talking in his old videos. He used to just be like, ah, bah, bah, bah. acted like he was talking, like he would do the text-to-speech robot voice, but he would act like he was saying it, like it was so stupid. You love the devil, just keep scrolling. But if you hate the devil... I didn't think that this guy could get even lazier, but now he doesn't even show up in the videos. Now, in the first video I made on him, I was calling him dumb, uh, like, multiple times. I said his channel was dumb, I said he was dumb, and I really don't care. But he seemed to care, because I remember I got a comment notification that he commented on that video I made on him. And he was like, I get more views than you, I get more subscribers than you. I don't care, buddy. You wanna know why I think you're actually genuinely dumb? This video says, if you laugh, you're going to hell. Do you notice anything wrong with this title? He used the wrong your. You are a 45 year old man and you don't have correct grammar? You might be thinking, DJ, everybody messes up. Everybody makes spelling mistakes. No, this isn't just a little mistake because he keeps doing it. This video right next to that one says, if you're laughing, you're going to hell. You used the wrong your twice? Once again, he said, if you laugh, you're going to hell. Do you not know English, bro? So this guy made laugh, you're going to hell, laugh, you're going to hell, laugh, you're going to hell, laugh, you're going to hell. He made this video one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight times in a row. And in every single one of these videos, he just used a picture of himself and then did the robot AI voice. You know how lazy that is? But guess what? He actually made some type of uh, original content right next to this one. It says, press three buttons if you love your mom. I have a feeling I know what this is. Press three buttons if you love your mom. Come on, it's your mom. That's literally all the video is? Press three buttons if you love your mom. He just sits there and goes. Press these three buttons if you hate this dumb ass guy. Come on, look at his stupid ah face. I was already getting fed up with this guy, but as I kept looking through his content, I started to realize that he was worse than I thought. The video he posted right before that one where it's like, oh, if you love your mom, click the buttons, is if you laugh, you go to hell. Don't tell me this is the same exact thing. If you laugh, you go to hell. Bro, oh my gosh. It's the same thing with the picture of him and the robot voice. Why do you keep doing this? He did it again right here. He did it again right here, again right here, and again right here. Oh my god. This video is a little bit different though. It says, if you love the devil, just scroll past this video. Oh my god. Bro, this is so lame. That is like the 
lamest thing you can do to get views. Let's see what this video is. I bet it's not even gonna be him talking. I've never heard him talk. Genuinely, let's see. It's gonna be a robot voice again, right? You love the devil, just keep scrolling. But if you hate the devil, like, comment, share. He literally made a video that says, if you love the devil, keep scrolling. But if you hate the devil, like, comment, and share. Like, he's trying so hard to get people to like and comment on his stuff. The devil doesn't give a damn whether you like this dude's video or not. And you wanna know the funny thing? This guy has never said a word in any of his videos. He just lip syncs the freaking robot AI voice. He has done this so many times that he has it perfectly. It genuinely looks like he's saying it because he's doing it so perfect. Look. Just keep scrolling. Look but at his lips. The devil, like. He Comment. knows exactly when to say each word because he's been doing this so many times. He's literally a pro at this. I did not know you could become a pro at being a horrible YouTuber. If you go to the comment section of this stupid video, people are saying, I love Jesus. I love God. I love God. I hate the devil. Yes, I like my own comment. Jesus team. Jesus is our savior. Bro, all of these little kids just got brainwashed into liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing to this dude's channel. Wow. This is actually getting out of hand. The next like 10 videos are the don't laugh or you go to hell. Like look, this one is, 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 this one is. Like you made 15 videos in a row of the same thing. If you laugh, you go to hell. You're not even in these videos. I'm gonna click a random one. I guarantee you. If you laugh, it's just a picture of him, bro, and a robot talking. And he just steals memes off the internet. You're not even in this video, bro. How can you claim that this is your video? How can you claim that this is your channel? How do you even feel creative? How do you even feel good when you wake up and you steal other people's stuff, put a picture of yourself on the side to claim that it's yours? How do you even feel good when you wake up, bro? Knowing that you're clickbaiting all these kids, making all these kids just brainwashed. How do you feel? I hope you do not have kids of your own. I really don't. Because if that's what they're watching, if that's what they have to live with, oh my gosh. No wonder our population is just going to crap. Oh, look at this. I finally found a unique video. It says, I bet you I can sing the ABCs. What? Anybody can say A, B, C, D, E, F, G. I mean, a three-year-old could do that. Why are you... Oh, I forgot. The people who watch his videos are like two years old. So, of course, he's making videos about ABCs. Let's see what this is, dude. I bet you I can sing the ABCs before you can like, comment, and share. Ready? Why does every single video this guy make have to do with like, commenting, and sharing and subscribing? Why does every single video have to do with that? You are forcing people to like, comment, and subscribe in every single one of your videos. How do people like this? And we're not even going to mention the fact that he didn't even sing. He was lip singing somebody else singing the ABCs. How is this even a unique video? How does YouTube even think that this is your video? You literally put yourself on a clip of somebody else's clip. You're using somebody else's audio. Bro, you're... This dude's just a thief, bro. Guess what? He finally made an original video. It says, I bet you that I win this game of Simon Says. Finally, he made something new. Let's see what this is. He's going to be playing Simon Says with us. You will lose this game of Simon Says. Simon Says, touch your nose. Simon Says, like this video. Simon Says, comment your favorite color. I looked at a lot of these videos in my first video I made on him. He used to do this. This used to be his main video. Simon Says, like the video. Simon Says, subscribe to me. And then Simon Says, share this with your friends. He's making little kids think that they're playing a game. Oh my gosh, we're playing Simon Says? I can beat you, bro. So let me like, let me comment, let me subscribe. He's making kids think that they're playing a game, but really he's just making them support his channel. He did this a ton back then. Two months ago, this was his main video idea. And now it's just, it's this hell thing. Laugh and you go to hell. You don't believe me? Well, look, look at what I just found. So he made a video that says, what girls text messages mean? Um, this is weird. I'm not watching that. I don't care about text messages, but look at this. Look at what came before it. The video before it was, if you laugh, you're going to hell. The video before that was, don't laugh or you'll be going to hell. The video before that says, don't laugh or you go to hell. The video before that says, if you laugh, you go to hell. That's, that's four videos in a row, right? Keep count. You better keep counting because it's it's so many. Look, if you laugh, you go to hell. That's five. If you laugh, you go to hell. Six. If you laugh, you go to hell. Seven. If you laugh, you go to hell. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. On the twelfth video, he literally misspelled you. If you poo, laugh, you go to hell. Like, he's done this so many times in a row that he forgot how to spell a word. That's twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. It keeps going. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. 36 videos in a row. If you laugh, you go to hell. And every single one of these videos, every single one of these 36 videos has a picture of him in the corner 
for five seconds and then he goes away. He doesn't show up in these videos at all. It's stolen clips from the internet. He shows his face for five seconds just so YouTube thinks it's his video and that he didn't steal it so he doesn't get copyright strike. 36 in a row. Are you serious? You're not gonna believe me again, but guess what? I scrolled a bit farther down on his channel and he did the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. I'm I'm not I'm done counting. This dude posts the same stuff over and over again. But that's not all he does. Because guess what? If you go to his live streams, apparently he streams decently often. Two weeks ago, he live streamed himself playing Call of Duty. Three weeks ago, he did the same thing. Three weeks ago, he did the same thing. He live streams himself just playing video games. He's in the thumbnail, but he's not in the video at all. But guess what? You know how earlier I said that this guy has never said a word in any of his videos? I wasn't lying. In all of his YouTube shorts, and trust me, he has 3,000 YouTube shorts, he has never said a word. It's been this robot every single time. But guess what I found? You're not gonna believe this, but I found a video where he actually talks, and it's not a good video. The video says, I will do one push-up for every like on this video. Doesn't that seem familiar? Well, guess what? A Couple of days ago, I made a video about the worst trend on YouTube, and there's a big trend going around where people are like, if uh, people like this video, I'll do push-ups. For every single like on this video, I'll fart. For every single like on this video, I'll do a backflip. Turns out, they never end up doing it. They're just begging for likes. This guy decided to join the trend, and it's the first time he's ever talked. For every like that this video gets, I'll live stream myself doing one push up. For every like that this video gets, I'll live stream myself doing a freaking push up. This dude sounds exactly like Morgs. He has that freaking like British accent. Why are all Britain people bad YouTubers? And guess what? Didn't he just say, I will live stream myself doing all the push ups? If you go to his live stream category, which we already were over here, he never made a live stream doing the push ups. You were making fake videos and now you're lying and making fake videos. I guarantee you he's gonna comment on this video and say, hey, I have 5 million subscribers. You only have like 800,000. Yeah, you're right, buddy. I'd rather have 800,000 real and cool subscribers than 5 million little brain brainwashed kids. If you want to see the first video I made on this guy, I went absolutely off on this guy in this video. This is when I first found him and I was just, I was so mad. I didn't know he was going to get worse though and he's worse now. But click that video if you want to see that or click right here to unsubscribe from my stupid channel. Peace.